So this is a, a very good question. Uh, and unfortunately, some people might be confrontational immediately because in our Christian centric culture, many people are just used to being entitled that they can say what they want, even if it reflects their beliefs and they don't align with yours. They think they're being helpful when they have never even considered that their words or their intentions aren't helpful at all. In fact, they're hurtful. So I just say that because no matter how you try not to be confrontational, it might get that way. And your la to your last point, you're right. You could ignore it, but you are a person and you have the right to the agency over your space and your body and what you find comforting. So the age of being quiet, I think we're, we're leaving that behind because the gatekeeper of our society for so long has been this Christian centric narrative that many of us are saying, I no longer want to ascribe to that. I no longer want to be silent to it, submissive to it, uh, even tolerate it because that does not align with who I am. So here are a couple of suggestions, and I do say it with that little asterisk that don't, regardless, it might come off as being offensive to somebody who then will center themselves in the narrative instead of what is most import important, which is caring for you. But if it were me, I would say something like, you know, I so appreciate, I know your heart is in the right place, but personally, praying for me is not helpful. It's actually hurtful. And I really don't want to get into that right now because I just need to stay focused on this urgent need I have, whatever that is or however, however much you're willing to share. Um, so please don't pray for me if you want to be helpful. Just tell me that you're sending love and that you're here for me because you know I care for you, but I just don't need you to say that you're praying for me. I hope that helps.